Welcome back to the video. I'm your tech guy Wayne and today I want to show you how to take a screenshot on the new Moto G Power 5G. It's a very simple process. What you'll need to do is hold down on the power and the volume down button for one second and let it go. So hold, let it go. That'll take a screenshot. It'll also put that screenshot in the bottom left corner and you can tap on it to swipe it away and once that screenshot is taken, it will go right to your Google Photos. So if you notice, I'm on the home screen, I simply just swiped up, and I'm going to the Google Photos app, click on Library, and go to Screenshots, and there's the picture that we just took. Now, that's not all. Let's try one more time. So power, volume down, you're just literally gonna hold and let it go. Hold, let it go. Now, if I tap on this little pencil, it will allow me to make some edits before it saves the picture. So keep that in mind. You might want to crop down to a certain section of the picture. You can do that from here. You may also want to select the, the little pen. And you may want to circle something or you may want to write something. So you can do all those edits from here. I can also tap on this little uh, text option and I can write something. You know, let's just say I write hello, and then I could change the background. I can move that and put that, put that right there. So you can make any uh, edits you would like before saving the picture. And you can also share the picture right from this screen as well. So I can tap on this little share button right here and I can send it to someone via text, via email, WhatsApp, Instagram, you name it. It'll use all the apps on your phone to be able to share it. You can also delete that picture by tapping the trash can or simply save it by just hitting that checkbox right there. So that picture is saved. We're going to swipe back up, go to our Google Photos once again, hit the back button, and now there's the picture that we just took. Now one more pro tip I want to show you, if you're not a big fan of Google Photos, which not everyone is, you can simply go to the Play Store and type in Gallery. G-A-L-L-E-R-Y, and Google just released a new uh, simplified gallery app, and it's just called Gallery, and you'll notice it's Gallery, and underneath it'll say Google LLC, so that's how you know it's the right one. Simply install this one. It doesn't have any ads. It's a very clean interface, and um, again, for those of you that are not a big fan of Google Photos, this is a, uh, a great stock gallery option. And when you open it up, you're going to just give it access for the first time. Hit continue. And as you can see, it's a very clean layout of your photos. There's a photo section and there's a photo, excuse me, there's a folder section. So right now there's just the screenshots. But as you take pictures, it will create separate folders for your camera and will also show any pictures that you have on a memory card will show up as well. So this is another great option if you're not a big fan of Google Photos. And that was our video guys, just a very simple walkthrough of how to take a screenshot on the new Moto G Power 5G. If you found this helpful, hit that like button down below. If you're not a rated subscriber, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Also, in the description, you'll find a link to a really great pair of headphones for under 30 bucks by JLab. So make sure you check that out as well if you're in the market for a new set of Bluetooth earbuds. Thanks again for watching. Take care, and as always, have a good one.